new Volkswagen up has over 63,000 customization options. The facelift Volkswagen up is on sale starting from 8,995 pounds with an electric version and a new 89 bhp turbo 2. The facelift and refreshed Volkswagen up went on sale back in July and since then Volkswagen has introduced the updated e up the all-electric version of its city car as well as a new range topping petrol engine. The e-up starts from £20,780 after the £4,500 government grant, while the new 89BHP 1.0-litre TSI engine is now available, priced from £11,350. The e-up packs an 80BHP electric motor, which provides enough pace to propel the e-up from 0 to 62 miles per hour in 12.4 seconds, and onto a top speed of 80 miles per hour. It boasts a range of 93 miles between charges, a very slight improvement on its predecessor's 90 miles. Surprisingly despite the 230 kg battery pack the E-Up is actually the lightest car in the Up range, at just 1,139 kg thanks to extensive weight-saving measures. The Up Range starts from 8,995 pounds, which will net you a take-up, fitted with a 5.9 bhp 1.0 liter petrol engine. The range consists of move up and high up. Models above this, with the e-up, sitting at the top of the range in price terms. For 8,995 pounds, you'll get a take-up with the 59 bhp 1.0 liter petrol engine. All cars feature the basic composition infotainment system, electric windows, remote central locking and driver's seat height adjustment. The mid-range move up. Model has 15 inch alloys, a touch screen infotainment system and Bluetooth connectivity, while the top spec high up. Has sat NAV, a multifunction steering wheel and a detailed trip computer. E up. Models are based on top spec high up trim and also add Volkswagen Carnet app functionality which allows you to check charge, review journeys and alter functions like the air conditioning from your phone. The standard 1.0 liter engine comes in either 59 bhp or 74 bhp form and both have a blue motion technology version that keeps CO2 under the magical 100 g slash km tax bracket. The all-new 1.0-liter TSI engine has 89 bhp and 160 nm of torque, which helps it go from 0 to 62 miles per hour in 10 seconds and onto a top speed of 115 miles per hour. It still manages 64.2 mpg, however, and that should mean CO2 emissions of around 102 g/km. The turbo joins the existing 59 bhp and 74 bhp 1.0 liter engines in the range, as well as the 80 bhp e up. European markets also get a 67 bhp echo up model, but that's unlikely to be offered in the UK. LED daytime running lights start off the exterior changes, with some new rear lights, door mirrors, a rear diffuser, and redesigned bumpers contributing to the up s new look. The fog lamps get a cornering function, too, and there are indicator lights inside the door mirrors. Inside, the revised up gets new seats, extra colors for the dashboard, a multifunction steering wheel and a new air conditioning system with an integrated air filter. Smartphone integration has been extended, too, with the facelift car benefiting from some new functions for the infotainment system that are controlled via your phone. There's a new up, beats trim level as well, complete with a branded speaker system. There are also a handful of new customization options for the new up, including 13 colors, 9 sticker designs, 3 roof colors and 2 interior colors. In top spec models you can add colored ambient lights inside the car, too. Volkswagen is keen to stress how customizable the latest version of its city car is, highlighting the 63,180 potential variations it is available in.
New wheel color options such as black, orange, and gold and beige are now offered, alongside a range of new interior customization packs. Standard kit now includes LED lights and remote central locking, while move up. Cars get a USB port, a bigger 5-inch display and a new smartphone-enabled radio system. The high up. Trim features the ambient lights, heated seats, buttons on the steering wheel and 15-inch alloy wheels. The new VW Up is available to order now, with TSI engine orders starting from August. It's priced from £8,995.